I came here in 1956 uh, fall, that would be 58 years. I think uh, the campus was uh, small at that time, I think we had about 9500 students in 1956. Uh, it was a very collegial and congenial place uh, for me to work and uh, I introduced many courses in the uh, outside, you know, the United States in the, on Asia in the non-Western world. Uh, so uh, we were interested in those uh, areas and we uh, were just beginning to uh, uh, teach uh, courses outside the uh, U.S. and uh, Europe. Uh, you know, the university was pretty much uh, Eurocentric at that time. Then uh, later on in the 1970s, uh, I took a students on field uh, summer field trip to uh, to India, and uh, we had uh, several sessions, you know, there for many years. Uh, this was before the study abroad program came into being on the campus, before there was any international education program. And uh, for the last uh, 25 years, we have been taking uh, students to Japan for the summer field uh, trip. Uh, it has been uh, it's one of the oldest programs, international uh, study abroad program <laughs> on, on the campus. Very few international students in the beginning, uh, 10, 20, and then uh, in the 80s it grew to about 100, and now I think we have four or 500 students. I don't have the real count, but I understand there are several hundred students from international students on the campus. Uh, so things have grown. We were a little bit slow, I think, uh, <laughs> on uh, Kentucky campus, uh, UK campus, but it has uh, worked out, you know, pretty uh, good. We have a very robust uh, international program at the present time. I think the administration realizes the importance of that. Uh, I think uh, students are more interested uh, now in uh, what they are learning. I find that change, you know, in the uh, early years, uh, there were uh, strongly motivated uh, students. Uh, they are more interested in the subject matter. They are more motivated. Uh, I think most of my students in uh, big classes are A's or B's, uh, some C's. Uh, I don't find any failing uh, students. Uh, it's a better uh, academic environment than what it was 50 years ago. Well, I like the challenge of the classroom. Yeah, I like to go, you know, interact with the students. It's fun. I like uh, research. Uh, so I combine research and teaching, uh, and uh, it has been a great uh, journey for me. I think internationalizing the curriculum and the campus is a great thing in this 21st century. Uh, we, uh, as a university, we cannot neglect that area there. So it's great to see that uh, emphasis on international education, and I'm glad to be a part of it uh, for a long time.